Hi guys, I'm filming this beach or pool makeup look. If you want to learn how to do it, just keep watching. I am going to mix my Revlon Color Stay Whipped in the color 370 Natural Tan with the Josie Marin Argan Illuminizer. Just mix those two together on your palette. I'm going to be using my Sigma F86 foundation brush to apply this. I'm sorry, that's the Sigma F80. Next, I'm going to be using the Pro Longwear Concealer in NC25 just to highlight and conceal under my eyes. I'll be using the Sigma F86 to blend this out and I'll also be blending it on my lid for an eyeshadow base. It looks like I'm rubbing this, but I'm actually stippling it in with the brush. Never drag your brush across your face. Always stipple in small motions. Now I'm setting this with the Revlon Color Stay powder and light. You always want to set your concealer so you don't crease underneath the eye. I'll be using my large tart brush with Estee Lauder Double Wear powder just to set the rest of my face. To bronze, I'm going to use the Lorac Tantalizer. This will give you a nice summer glow.
For brows, I'm using the Anastasia Brow Wiz. Just a quick, fast fill in your brows. Nothing too crazy for the beach or the pool. Next, I'm going to be using a large fluffy brush and I'm going to put a transition shade. This is out of the BH Cosmetics 120 color palette. It's just a nice bright orange color and I'll be putting that in windshield wiper motions from the inner corner to the outer corner. doesn't have to be perfect, just get it all over the crease from the inner to the outer. Next I'll be using Makeup Geek Foiled Eyeshadow in the color In The Spotlight. And I like to put this on my finger, it just comes off a little bit more vibrant with your finger rather than a brush. color from the BH Cosmetics palette. Just putting that under my eye with the pencil brush. Putting a little bit of in the spotlight in the tear duct of my eye. Just 
a tiny smudge of black to the outer corner just to give it a tiny bit of depth. Just make sure you blend it all out. We don't want any lines or creases where two colors meet. BH Cosmetics palette again and it's kind of a goldish goldish white color then just blending it out highlight I'm going to be using the Make It Forever Pro Sculpting Duo in number one. For blush, I'm using the Morphe Brush Palette in 9B, and it's the top right blush. This blush is so pigmented, it's so beautiful. And just blend that out with the Duo Fiber Brush. Lashes, I am not going to use falsies since we're going to the beach or the pool. I'll be using the Miss Magna mascara first. And then for my lower lashes, I'll be using the CoverGirl flamed out mascara on the lower lashes. This mascara does not smudge underneath my eye like the other one does. And I'll just put a little bit over that of the top lashes also.
For a lip liner, I'll be using the NYX Lip Liner in Dolly Pink. For lipstick, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Shocking Coral number 870. And then I'm going to use Bite Cosmetics, the High Pencil Pigments in Corvina on top of that, just to give it more of a coral look. And our look is finished. I hope you guys liked it and if you do please thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys.